people say like, how do I get out of it? How did you get out of it? You don't get out of it. You don't get out of life experiences, guys. You move through it. So the best thing to ask of divinity and creation and to attract voices and insights that will help myself and you guys and everybody else on our journey, it's best to ask, how do I get through it? Not how do I get out of it? Because honestly, guys, when whatever plan of intelligence came forward for us to incarnate into these bodies, we were brave in spirit. We wanted to dance with awareness. We go through something so hard and we don't have the resolve and we don't have the understanding and we caught a bigger fish than we were able to handle, we can really feel down on ourselves. We can really feel like something went wrong. And when we are provided the insight after, we, after we're able to come in from that, that huge adventure and come in for comfort and food and sustenance and here there are people and guides and we attract different things in our life that said this was exactly supposed to happen you did it come on in rest and think about what you learned you sat on the chair again it held you despite all your fears and everything else and you became new and better and wonderful and remade and you're an absolutely different version with a new consciousness and a new awareness circulating through you than you ever were before that's a reason for gratitude that is what brings our that's what brings new life into us and new adventure for life it makes it us able to be braver and more courageous to take on new paths and, and, and new transformations in life And I was in total bliss. My whole body was tingling with fire. We wanted to explore the limitations of being in a human body and in human flesh and learning compassion and love and limitations in this form. The spirit wanted that dance. <laughs>